Okay, another short video. I've got both channels up and running. You can see the two neons running off the two CFLs. So I've got my two channels. I'm driving them off of my signal generator. At, um, both channels are 10% duty cycle, and channel B is 180 degrees out of phase. Let me see if I can adjust that. Better. There we go. Yeah, so you can see that the uh, the red one, channel A, and then there's the other one, which is channel B. A little better. So, with these two channels uh, in control now, I can uh, work on the. Um, Channel driving logic later, I'll just depend on the signal generator now with its parameters. <clears throat> and uh, I will use this 2000 volts output to now connect into the horizontal rings and play with the combinations that way to see uh, how I can drive the, um, the uh, top and bottom uh, ring as they're tanked, which are those which are those two coils that I showed in the schematic with, two transformer, with the transformer action. <clears throat> and we can play with the combinations and then iron and all that from there. Um, then when I get that, you know, when I see the best results of that, I can then pump up the uh, high voltage to about 30,000 volts and see what happens at that point. 30,000 volts is a mild, mild stun gun operation. They usually start at uh, 100,000 volts. So I can, uh, I got room to play. And before I turn the high voltage on, which can be quite damaging, I'll um, use this uh, low voltage configuration to see what I can get. Playing with the uh, input parameters to the uh, signal generator and uh, the connections to the coils. That's all for now.